Hola mis amores, Johnny here, and by the title of this video you know that I'm gonna be unboxing and showing you all my BoxyCharm Premium of this month. I have all of the goodies in here, I don't have any makeup on because I have some skincare products that I'm gonna be using, so let's get into it. And if you didn't know, BoxyCharm Premium is a makeup subscription box that delivers to your home six full size products of makeup and skincare for only $39.99 a month, and you get to pick two of them. So let me show you what I got in my box. And let's do a look with it. The first product that I got in my box was the Advanced Skincare Blue Volcanic Purifying and Antioxidizing Cleansing Gel. And this retails for $110. I have gotten other Avant products in the past and they are all really, really, really expensive because of the ingredients that they have. This is a really, really good cleanser. It's made in Italy. It retails for $110, which is wild to think that a box that only retails for $40 can bring you one plus other five products that are a lot more of the value, you know what I mean? I already cleansed my face, but I still wanna put a little bit of the moisturizer in my hands, just so y'all can see the texture of it. As you can see, it's very, very liquidy, and it's kind of like a gel, which I actually love. I think that this is gonna be great for removing my makeup after the day, you know? And every time that I get an Avant product, I get really, really happy because of the quality of the ingredients that they have. Let me know in the comments down below if you have tried any Avant products in the past and if you like them. The next product that I got in my box is this one right here. This is the Herbivore Botanicals Rose Hibiscus Hydrating Face Mist. And this is just a hydration face mist that it's based with coconut water and you use this after you cleanse your skin to bring up the hydration. So now that my skin is clean, I feel like this is gonna be a perfect step before I apply my whole makeup and my foundation and everything. This is kind of like a primer of the primer. <laughs> First of all, the spray, okay. It's not too much, but it's also not too little. Let's put it on my face. Oh my god, this smells so delicious. Yeah, it has like a little bit of a rose coconutty flower effen scent to it. And I honestly love, love, love. If you think about it, it's kind of like a hydration face mist. It's not something that I'm really gonna be using a lot, unless I kind of have it like right in front of me and I'm like, okay, there we go. I do have to say it doesn't feel sticky at all on my skin. I'm still not sure if this is really gonna be a product that I'm gonna love and I'm gonna be like using a lot, but it's not bad, honestly. Like, it retails for $34. I don't know, the more I apply it, I feel like... I feel like this is gonna be good maybe on that really, really hot summer day that I'm coming back from the beach. Oh, this would be great to take to the beach, actually. Now, the more I think about it, I don't think that this is something that I'm gonna apply like for my makeup or skincare routine. But I'm definitely gonna throw this in my beach bag because this is gonna be super refreshing whenever I'm out there and I need, you know, that extra pick me up. <laughs> the next product that I got in my premium box is this one right here. This is the Aceology Brightening Treatment Mask. I actually have tried this Aceology mask in the past. I think I had the pink packaging one. They usually recommend this to use it twice a week for optimal results. And this is a brightening treatment mask. So I'm actually not gonna be using it in this video. I feel like I don't need to do a mask right now. And just so you know, she retails for $69. Have you tried any Aceology products in the past? I personally have tried their Gua Sha tool. And actually, my favorite lip mask is also from Aceology. I have it right here in front of me. This is their overnight lip mask and this is a really 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 good lip mask I just whenever I need to re-moisturize my lips and I know that I've done a lot of like lip swatches and stuff like that I run to use this so if this mask is as good as this I'm definitely gonna be loving it so the first three products that I got in my box were skincare so now let's go into the makeup products that I got and for the makeup I'm really 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 excited because I mean I I can't say, like, I don't need to say much. Look at this. I have Lunar Beauty Moon Prism Palette. The first makeup product that I got is the Rodile Glass Primer. And if you have seen my TikTok, you actually have already seen me use this primer. It comes in this gorgeous packaging. And when I tell you, this is 
literally amazing. I'm gonna apply it only in the half of my face, just so y'all can see the difference of it. It really makes your skin look like glass of how reflective and how illuminating it is. I'm just gonna continue to blend that only on one side, just so you can see the difference between one side and the other. Let me know if you see a difference. This is the side that has the primer, this is the side that doesn't have it. But I'm gonna go ahead and apply this all over my face as well because like I said in the past, I have used this primer and I really, really love how my skin looks whenever I use it. And this primer retails for $39. The next product that I got in my box was this one. This is actually not one, but two Luxie Beauty All-Purpose Sponge. I do have to say the packaging is not really the best, but you know, I really don't care much about this because I do trust Luxie Beauty a lot and oh my goodness, these are so soft, y'all. I'm not sure what's going on, but this one has a different kind of texture on it than this one. I need to read, hold up, hold up. I'm so let me read what's going on. I couldn't really find why these wear a little bit of a different texture or a color online, to be honest. I just couldn't even see them on their website. Maybe it's not available right now, but I'm intrigued. And I'm definitely gonna be using this right now to blend my foundation. Before I go in and do my foundation, I actually want to go ahead and do my eye makeup. And for that, I'm gonna be using the Moon Prism Palette. That was the last product that I got in my BoxyCharm box this month. This is a palette from Lunar Beauty. As you can see, if you have seen other videos on my channel, you probably have seen that I have already used this palette a lot. I really, really love this palette. I actually have talked to Manny in the past and I have told him how much I love this palette because it includes literally all of the shades that I need to do a neutral eye look and then also all of these beautiful road of shimmers. If you want to see my review of this palette alone, click right here. I'm to pay 50k for Burzno album out. Yeah, my mommy's so dull that my baby gotta climb it. <laughs> if you know, if, if you know from where, if you know what song I'm singing right now, let me know in the comments down below. If you think about it, I can't really have music when I'm filming videos and I'm talking to y'all, so I have to like play the music in my head when I'm getting ready and sometimes I just start singing, you know, cause like, cause you pull up in that monster automobile against that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> let me cut this. I feel like I've been thinking a lot about what kind of look I want to do for this video and because I have already used and kind of like show y'all looks with the shimmer shades, I'm gonna do a look for this one only using the mattes. With a Luxie 209 brush, I'm gonna take the shade Apricot. I'm gonna tap off the excess from the shade and then I'm gonna apply it just in the outer part of my eye. Wow, y'all. <laughs> I I mean, I already you you all have already seen me, so I'm, I'm not gonna tell you much about like the texture and the quality of the shades because you know that this is really really beautiful. At this moment, I'm just stamping the shade where I wanted most of the concentration of the shade to be. Now with a different fluffy brush, I'm just gonna start blending this shade upwards. I'm not really surprised, like I have already used this palette and I have already love how easy these shades they blend. Look at that, that's so, so smooth and faded. Now I'm gonna take this baby pink shade right here, it's called Sherry Blossom and I'm taking this with a flat Anastasia Beverly Hills brush. Once again, tapping the excess off. In this shade, I'm just gonna start swiping it all over the eye to kind of like open up my eye a tiny bit. How beautiful! I just love when two shades they blend in so perfectly and like that you don't even see the connection or where you place the other shades, you know, like that's how you know. This kind of eye shape, usually I like to do it whenever I want my eye to look big. Because as you can see, it's kind of like elongating and opening my eye a little bit more. And now we go back in with that blending brush again and we just blend out those edges so you know, we make sure that everything is blended and smooth. I, I really like it so far, so let me do the other one and I'll be right back. And voila! How easy. <laughs> now to finish this eye look, I'm gonna take the shade Sakura in a really fat, tiny brush. And this shade I'm gonna apply it under the eye. And with that, we finish this eye look. I am going to finish it up, put lashes, put mascara, put liner, and I'll be right back. 
Okay, so before I come back with the final look, I do wanted to show y'all. I'm using right now the Luxie sponges. They're soft, uh, but to be honest, I don't like them. Like just being 100% honest with you. Like they're a little bit, I just think that they're a little bit too soft for me and they're like kind of absorbing a lot of the product, to be honest. I want a sponge or a product that kind of like moves the product around and not really absorbs too much. And I think that this is doing exactly that. So I don't really like it, but I'll be right back with the final look and let y'all in. And, and I hope that y'all will like it as much as I do. Look at these shimmers, y'all. This is the road of shimmers in the middle. I decided that I will be using one of them for the final look. And voila, mis amores. This is the final look. What do you think? I love the result of this makeup look, specifically the face. I think it looks super shiny, super bright, and super beautiful, which I know that it's because of that primer, because I love that primer so much. And also the eyeshadow look. Of course, it's a little bit simple, but I think with the lashes and with the accessories, it looks really, really good. And I feel like I'm ready to go out and enjoy my night out, you know what I mean? <laughs> For sure, the killer of this box was definitely the nude prism palette from Lunar Beauty. I mean, she's stunning she is gorgeous she's an icon she's the moment she is the legend I mean come on now I really really love creating this look with all of the products that I got in my boxes on premium box I want to know what did you get in your boxes on premium box so let me know in the comments down below and now that you're down there don't forget to click the subscribe and the bell button so you can get a notification every time that I upload a new video like this one I'll see you in the next one mis amores bye <laughs>